Kia ora, welcome to my happy place. If you like today's video, please give me a thumbs up, leave a comment so I know that you've been, don't be shy, and please enjoy. Right, I've come on to make some spring um, ATCs and um, spring is the prompt this month for Nina Rabina's art journal prompts and more and we can do autumn or spring but um, I need um, some spring ATCs for a swap so I'm going to combine the two. Now I don't know if this is going to work but I'm going to have a little trial and I'm going to just put some paint down there give it a mush about and I'm going to see if I can do this watercolour um, that you can get with um, the inks and I don't know if you can I'll be able to it might just be a big stuff up but we will see how we go Bit more of that in there just mush around and just pull this over a bit and bring you up a bit go that way and uh, we will see how we go this doesn't work out well you won't know all right i'll just give those a dry off and this one could do with a bit more and see what happens all right that's what they're looking like with their first color on so I'll try again and see how we go. Keep on forgetting to wipe my fingers off in my book that I've got over here. Oh, that's looking quite cool. my birthday in 10 days and I haven't been asked yet what I want I'm hoping to be able to buy a set of um, what are they called <laughs> gone from my brain again well, I'm quite liking the look of that I'll just mop up that what's left of that in my book and give these a dry off if we can come up a bit closer and go this way a bit and there they are all right this is what they're looking like so far and i hope you can see that a lot better than what i can this is not showing up very good in my monitor. Right now, we have got some periwinkle blue. It's a little bit. Just a little bit much. <laughs> I 
Yeah, I'll just give this a bit of a mix up and try again. Mm. Mm. Don't know if I'm liking that. I'll give it a dry off and see what it looks like. Just give this one a bit of water on it to thin it down. what they're looking like. Knock them off with my paper towel. This one's looking quite cool actually. Let's keep it on the, on the dry. That's what they're looking like. They're not too bad. Coming out different than I thought they would but we'll see how they go. All right, then still need to dry off. All right, that's better. That's what they're looking like. I'm not unhappy with it at the moment. Right now, it won't be so heavy here handed this time. All right. Wiping off the ex excess into my little book. And... Push it around with it. those are dry off and then I'll be back. I just dry off with my towel. That's what it's looking like. I hope you can pick up the colours. too bad. Might add a little bit of um, the colours back in something when they're all dry. Right, what have we got now? We have got some rose quartz. It's a really pretty colour. dry off. Right, we'll give them a pet off. Happy with them. All 
right, my last colour is Panini Blush. Just wipe my fingers off on my little book. Just um, take a bit off it and then see how we go. Smush. Oops. And hang up my towel to dry, and I'll give these a dry off, and then I will be back. All right, this is what it's looking like. As I say, I'm not unhappy with them, but I'd like to bring the colours back bolder. So I think that I am going to use my Punchinella to bring the colours out. And I think I'm going to go with... a lot of blue in the background so I don't know if we'll put more blue in. Off on my book. I'll just give it a bit of a wipe off now. Right. Alright, now our purple. Another. Now purple is cool. Laid back lilac. Did you see what I did there? Picked that up by mistake and really I was going to wipe some off on my book and it stuck. <laughs> Trust me. Trust me. some of that off. No, just made a mess of it, but that's okay. We'll add some over the different colours over the top to fix it. Right. We'll go back to our yellow. Just 
take the purple out. And a bit of our green. Just to put some back in. Right, now. I shall give those a dry off. Right. Now we will go for some pink. Be a bit more careful this time. Don't want it to be This one into, into shot. Right. right now, I think we need to bring a bit of blue back in. Too heavy handed. Hmm. I'm liking those. Right, I'm back and I've got some little stamps, and I thought I'd put some little stamps on, on them. So I really know what else to put on them, so and I don't want them to be bulky. Dragonfly. Mm. Oh. Don't know. Don't know. But we'll see how we go. It's a little scribbly flower that I think I'd just. Never um, done an ATC like this. I've always collaged on mine, but I thought I'd try something different because they're going overseas. They're easier to post because so I've got quite a few swaps on. All right, now. A little butterfly here, we might add our little butterfly. Right, don't know about that. Might find a colourful butterfly to go over it, but I'm not really sure. But I'll give it a give it an edge, and I want to put a word on it. Alright, so 
on the pin. Not that one. Do well. I think they do have, um, oh, I don't know, do they have peelers on them or not? No, I don't think they do. Butterflies do. Right. Shall find some words. All right, I'm back with my words. I just printed them off with my um, brother label maker. Put a bit of white on to the Butterflies just to stand them out a bit. Those are my spring ATCs. Thank you for being with me, Kia Kaha, stay strong. And I'll catch you again soon.